All right, HVAC Smart Building Control Specialist. Have you ever had a client who goes, data, data everywhere. I want you to get the data out of my system so that it's usable. Well, if you're like most of us, you know that's easier said than done. And why is that the case? Well, you're going to find out in this video, so watch it all the way to the end, where we're going to talk about a new tagging convention that can have you be very, very price competitive when your clients ask you to get the data out. The following is a presentation of the Control Trends Podcasting Network. Hi, this is Eric Stromquist with ControlTrends.com and Stromquist.com. Okay, we've been in the business for a long time. I'm a distributor of master systems. I'm a master distributor of uh, building automation controls, along with my co-host on Control Talk Now, the Smart Buildings videocast and podcast, Ken Smyers. So we see these systems every day, and we work with integrators just like you when they have problems they need to solve. So... I say tomato, you say tomato. I say potato, you say potato. We're essentially saying the same things. We're just saying it differently. And if you've ever been accused or called a link monkey, you know what I'm talking about. Because when they want to get the big data to bring it out to make their buildings more efficient, you basically have to link those pieces of data up. Well, why is that? Well, if you think about it, I might say air handling unit number one, for example, I might call it AHU1. You might write it out, air handling unit number one. Ken Smyers would probably call it the air handling unit number uno. In any case, when you label things differently, then somebody has to manually go in and click on the links to make it work. Okay, so there's a new convention called Haystack Connect. It's a tagging convention. And it's really kind of a translator. So if Ken Smyers wants to call it air handling unit numero uno, it'll automatically translate that through a library to AHU1. So basically, anybody on one side can call it whatever they want to call it, but it gets translated back to, okay, a, con a tagging convention that's universal. What this means is you can extract data from units almost instantaneously because the system knows what's what, what the sensors are called and everything else because it's an agreed upon tagging convention. And it just makes it, makes it super, super easy to get data out for your customers. Okay, so hey, before we go any further, please hit the subscribe button below. Give us a like. We love the love, and we're going to now take you to an expert we did uh, where we actually do a deep dive on Haystack Connect. And watch the end of that video because there's a special offer for you. So one of the changes we're going to make on the show is we're going to have a deep dive post of the week. And we'll take one post and we'll go and do, go a, do a deeper dive on it. So Kenny, what is the deep dive post on the show this week? Well, it's uh, the 2019 Haystack Connect and, and Project Haystack. And, and a little bit more about the, uh, the networking, uh, the sharing, the creating of synergies, the generating of business opportunities. But as we all know, haystack tagging turns thousands of complex data points into efficient dashboards, meaningful alarms, and simple schedules. So what we're seeing, Eric, is we're seeing the implementation and, and, the, and the development of a protocol that's going to make our worlds uh, simpler, easier, faster, more efficient, and get to those you know, those, those desired points without any in, deliberately meddlesome, uh, you know, traffic. In other words, yeah. so if something comes out of, of a box and it's, temp, you know, it's registered or it's, it's using Haystack or somebody creates an app and it has Haystack, we're going to start seeing in a couple of years that'll become, you know, probably uh, the protocol of choice because it has so well, many merits. Right. Well, it's, you know, and we were there at the very first meeting. We've been to every single Haystack convention. And, and like as Kenny saying, Haystack really is a tagging convention, an agreed upon tagging convention. And the stuff it allows you to do it wasn't that you couldn't do it before, but there's a term. And, and if you've been called this, you, you know, it's, it's not a derogatory term, but it, it was just sort of a reality called a link monkey. And basically, if you wanted to, to get data out, you basically had to manually go into your software you had to link different pieces of data up and pull them out. So it was very, very time consuming. And this sort of came about because people want to extract the data from their systems where they can make it usable, all right? But it was just cost prohibitive because it was not an agreed upon tagging convention. So Kenny might call an air handle or air handle, write it out unit one. I might call it AHU one. Scott Mench would probably call it drone one because he's a drone captain. But now with this convention, it's kind of the best of all worlds because you can call it all those things, but then it's going to translate to one meaning. And then that, what that allows your integrators to do is to extract this data without having to 
the cost of being a link monkey. So we've watched over the years when this first came out, our first meeting in Chattanooga, Tennessee, Kenny, I mean, you know, it was, it was kind of tough sledding there. Nobody really adopted it, but it's such a great idea that the manufacturers, the biggest one being Tritium, you know, came out in the not too distant past and said, we, we are accepting this standard now. So it is really and truly the stuff if you are a user or a consulting engineer, you want to ask and make sure that haystack tags are included in your controllers, in your system. If you're an integrator, you want to become part of the haystack organization. If you're, you know, and if you're a distributor, you better know what it is too. And, and the great news is if you're not caught up on this yet, you will be because there's a big event coming up in San Diego, right, Kenny? Oh, there sure is. In fact, the registration uh, might be closing down. That was one of the, our, our midweek uh, uh, urgencies was that, you know, these early bird registrations uh, are, are closing. I think, uh, Haystack, uh, you may, if you look at it today, uh, being Sunday, uh, March 17th, it might, might, might have missed the, uh, the close off. But yeah, so the registration hotel, we have that link right on our, our website. And, uh, you know, you can book your, held, book your hotel room directly through the Haystack Connect website for discounted conference rates. So that's, that's, that's a good incentive. Uh, it gives you good details on the sponsors, uh, the exhibit halls, the agendas, the speakers. In fact, there's still a call for speakers um, for the Haystack Connect. Uh, it's in a beautiful area. I mean, we have a picture of the resort. It's at the, um, the uh, resort area is in San Diego. In fact, it's not too far from where my uh, – my daughter is, and and uh, see here. So let's just look at the. Might have to give me some mercy here while my computer decides if it's going to. Okay, just, I just put another point in there. It's, it's a private island paradise. So this is going to be at Paradise Point, a San Diego Island Resort, and it, it's it's extraordinary. It's beautiful. Uh, it's uh, it's going to be uh, so all the downtime is going to be out near the beach. Or you know, just in a beautiful environment. So it's got all the components of being a very worthwhile, important um, networking. But like you said, going into the deep dive, you know, the the technical information that the is, is Haystack it, it provides a unique, open forum for professionals involved in automation, control, Internet of Things to learn and share the latest technologies and techniques for connecting systems and utilizing data device data and applications, including intelligent buildings, energy management, remote monitoring, and other IoT devices and applications. And this year's conference, of course, is May 13th through the 15th at Paradise Point Resort. And, and I just want to do some name dropping again. You know, some of the industry stalwarts that we've had, like John Petsy, Mark Petock, Brian Frank, uh, you know, Scott Mench, you mentioned him earlier, and, you know, Jason Briggs. We're seeing the critical mass here and the OEMs that are involved are, are making this thing inevitable. So it's not a question of, of, of if you're going to get onto the project haystack train or, or the, you know, haystack templating, it's not a question of if it's a question of when. And, and so, right. Well, and we've seen so many great uh, demonstrations, I, you know, I, compliments to both uh, Jason Briggs and Scott Mench, because the very first one we went to, they get up, they got up on stage in their overalls and their their straw hats, and they essentially live in front of an audience without a safety net, connected all these diverse systems almost instantaneously through the use of haystack tags. We saw them do it again in Colorado Springs. So the power of haystack, I mean, it's palatable when you see how quickly they were able to bring on systems from all around the city in. Almost instantaneously, it's phenomenal. I'm not doing it justice. You have to see it to believe it. As a matter of fact, I think on Control Trends, we might have some videos of them doing that. We do, we do. But the videos didn't even do it justice. So if you haven't been to a Haystack Connect, uh, beg, borrow, steal, plead. Tell them Ken and Eric sent you. You know, like Kenny said, the dates might have passed, but hey, we know people. So just uh, we'll, we'll help you out if you really want to go, and you should want to go. So yeah, well, as Forrest, as Forrest Gump says, that's what I have to say about that. Okay, that's it, Control Pros. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed that. Remember, like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already. Go to controltrends.com. You can check us out and get out to Haystack Connect. It will be a fabulous, fabulous conference. Okay, so with that, be bold and stay in control. See you next time.